In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to set up your Facebook advertising account and how to create your first Facebook advert. First thing we're going to do is go over to Facebook.com and on Facebook page, you'll have your normal login screen and sign up screen, but down at the bottom, you'll see we've got a couple of options here and one of the options is to create an advert. So we'll select the option to create an advert, which will bring us to the Facebook advertising page. Okay, so here is a lot of information on how it works, success stories, um, how, you know, how to create adverts, best practice for adverts and so on. A lot of interesting reading here. But I'm going to head over here to this but green button here, which says create an ad. So we'll select create an ad. Now Facebook works a little bit back to front in that it requires you to create an ad first and then set up your account. You need an existing Facebook account, so if you do not have one, create one for yourself. I've got one ready that I will use to do this with. So I will log in with our account. And what you'll see is, is the Facebook ad screen. So this is how you create an ad. Now you can create an advert in Facebook that either directs people to an external URL or to a page in your Facebook account, so one of your Facebook pages. For now, we're going to use an external URL. So again, we're going to use tradeallstars.com.au. Now what will happen is Facebook will actually go and visit the site quickly. It will go and grab some graphics and things that it can find on on the page and it will sort of come up with a basic advert. So this is what the advert looks like that Facebook has created for us automatically. It's coming soon, it went and it got the logo there and so forth. Now because we're setting up the account now, what we do here with the advert is not really important. In a subsequent video I'll go into more details of what everything means on this screen. I'm just going to go over this quickly. What we will do here is just quickly fix this up a little bit being part of the trail. Um, let's leave it like that. Uh, okay. Now down here, you can see at the moment we've got the United States selected as a country, which gives us 160 million people that this ad will, ad will reach. We're actually going to be focusing this advert on Australia. So we'll just select Australia. Um, immediately you'll see it goes down to 11 million people. We've got a lot less people in Australia than they have in the States. Now, here you can select some broad categories. We'll just select some broad categories for now. Um, it says small business owners. Now, that will immediately reduce the number of people that this advert will be exposed to. Now, you can add further, further more specific things in there, which we will get to later. I'm not going to worry about that now. Now down here is what's, what's important. As we are busy setting up the account, we have to decide what currency we want to be building. In this case, we're going to select Australian dollars. Which country we are in, I'm going to select Australia. We're going to Australia. Time zone, we're going to select Perth as our time zone. New campaign, we'll just call it Trade All Stars for now. We'll leave the budget on $20 per day. What you'll see here is based on the advert that we've created, it's estimated that we need a bid of between $54 and $1.25 per click. Now what that means is, is it is what we are willing to pay for each click. Now it's automatically gone and put it right in the middle, or roughly in the middle, at $0.72 cents per click. So we will accept that setting. Now we select place, place, place order. Since we haven't set up our, our advertising account before, it will come up with this form that will ask us to complete our payment details. So now we can select credit card, continue. At this point it will take us to a secure form where we can complete our credit card details. Now this is the credit card that will automatically be billed for any spending that you do on advertising. Now you've got complete control over which adverts run and which don't run, but if your advert runs and people click on it, it will accumulate a cost and Facebook will be taking the money out of this bank account. 
So once you've completed your credit card details, just click Submit, and your account will have been set up. Once you've set up your advertising account with Facebook, when you log into Facebook the next time, you'll see there's a new section here called Adverts. And in there, there's an Adverts Manager. So if we select that, you'll be taken to the Adverts Manager section of, of Facebook. And this is where you manage everything with regards to your ad campaigns, to your adverts, to your billing information, and some general settings. What I want to quickly show you is how to add another user to your account. This will allow the new user that you've added to be able to create adverts on your behalf. Now this is very useful if you work with somebody that is going to help you with the adverts. So head over to the settings area and if you scroll down a little bit here are some general settings but if you scroll down a little bit you'll see there's a permissions section. Now what we're going to do is select add user and we're going to create another person, we're going to set another person up to be able to post ads on our behalf. So we're going to create a general user and it says here general users can see, edit your adverts and set up adverts using the funding source associated with your account. So the person here will have will be able to create adverts on your on your behalf. So all you need to do is to find the right person like this and I'll use Alicia select add user and now you see Alicia has been added to my account. So now Alicia will be able to post adverts on my behalf. Now when I stop working with Alicia and I don't want her to have access to my account anymore, I can just remove her here. Now it's important to note that this person only has access to your advertising account. They don't have access to anything else within Facebook. So it is really safe to give somebody access, somebody that you trust to make adverts for you, it's safe to give them access here. You can come in at any point and you can simply click here and remove the person from your account.